Again we meet, son of Argus. Surprised to see me, Aztec? This time, I shall take your life. You are a half-god. The first-born son of Argus. That claim holds no water. You are the only son of Argus. Ah, I have half-brothers, Taven and Dagon. Are they as insufferable as you? The bastard son of Argus. I am the heir, Garrus. Not in this or any other timeline. Where are Taven and Dagon? Looking to make peace with your brothers? To prevent them from claiming my throne. I require your skills, Collector. These hands only serve Shao Kahn. No one denies the son of Argus. You have the information I seek? I can lead you to Dagon and Tavin. Tell them, or pay the price. Taven and Dagon must die. But won't that unleash Armageddon? And the power of Blaze will become ours. Kronika's offer was insufficient. The world was not enough, Rain. Not for the son of Argus. Balancing the realms is Mother's will. Leave that work to the sons of Argus. Taven and Dagon had their chance. Round one, fight! Kronika was dead, the hourglass taken, and Adenia's future mine to command. I had obtained all I had wanted. All except that which I had wanted most to know the true story of my parentage. That I was a bastard I knew, born of an illicit affair between the Edenian god Argus and a mortal woman, Amara. But what I didn't know until the hourglass showed me was that I and my mother were both victims. She hadn't abandoned me. Thanks to my father's lies, she had thought me stillborn. I was stolen away and left to rot among peasants, while my mother died from grief. Argus hid his scandal and his shame by killing the one person who ever loved me. For that, he will die. As will his sons, Taven and Dagon. His beloved wife, Delia, she I will let live. Let her heart break as my mother's did, as she weeps over her children's corpses. 